When you're having Trump on. I don't know. Okay. You, you, the look, I don't know. Maybe. Looks like you got something. Maybe. Okay, good. That's good. I think that's. Uh, I look, at a certain point in time, it's just like, it would be interesting to hear his perspective on a lot of things. I would like to know what is it like when you actually get into office? I would like to know things like, what what is it like versus perception? Yeah. What is it actually like when you get in that building? Like, what 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 are you greeted with? When do you know that people are fucking with you? When do you know that the intelligence agency is lying to you? Like, when you decided to fire Comey, what was the thought? How much did you know? Like, what what's the machine like? What is what is the deep state really like? Really like? Because we have all these, you know, smoky room perceptions, like from the Bill Hicks joke, where they show you the Kennedy assassination from an angle you've never seen before. You know, what is the machine that runs this country? Because it's very clear that it's not as simple as elected representatives that are doing the will of the people. It's not. Yeah, I'm, I'm really looking forward to seeing you and Trump together. Ah, you keep pushing that. I, I think, okay, I'll tell you from my perspective, like, uh, on why you ought to consider it when you do do it. I'll just give you my, um, okay. just so you know, he and I don't speak. You know, it's not something that is like, hey, his camp saying go in there and do this and do that. No, I've never interviewed the guy. So it's not like I'm, you know, uh, lobbying for it. But I think if, you know, when you think about sports or you think about fights, what is the boxing world if Frazier Ali never happens, right? Uh, what is the UFC world? If DC John Jones doesn't happen or Khabib Connor doesn't happen and they're both at their peak and those fights don't happen, we can go on with sports, you know, with baseball, with, you know, uh, interviews of Oprah Winfrey, Michael Jackson, you know, you go look at, you know, uh, some of these things that happen with Larry King or her and, uh, uh, you know, a bunch of different guys. He's a guy that's probably the most misunderstood by a side. And a guy that... Uh, How do you think he's misunderstood in what way? I, I think I think the media has really painted this guy to be evil. I had, you know, like, I like to talk to people I fully disagree with. And I, I think they're delusional in certain areas to understand, like, what makes you believe what you just said? Right. Like, I don't understand what you just said. Right. Tell me how you could be that convinced you're right. 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 I, Cenk was on the podcast yesterday. And... Jenk is convinced he's a better businessman than Trump. What's up, everyone? Hope you guys are having a great day today. You watch your own air, Nick Jarvis, Nick Jarvis podcast. Happy Wednesday, October 23rd. For the people that have been hanging out over the last few days, thank you so much uh, for hanging out and, and bearing with me. I have had the flu or something uh, since Sunday, so I haven't been uploading uh, hardly anything up until now. So thank you guys, and I am back on it. And this is great news, man. This is great news. So we are looking at Trump going on Joe Rogan's podcast on Friday, October 25th. It should be a banger, man. It should be a banger. And as you can tell, it's going to be amazing because everyone on the left is losing their mind. CNN is losing their mind. And there's just so much going on here, man. There's so much going on. Let's check out some of the headlines here. Yeah, so here we go. We're looking at our ground news here. Trump to be interviewed by podcaster Joe Rogan. That is uh, 7 News Australia. Trump said to appear on Joe Rogan podcast. Trump scores a Joe Rogan interview for the first time with an eye on male voters. Trump will reportedly appear on Joe Rogan's podcast. Is Harris next? This must be a left outlet. That's right. That's right. This is a left outlet. Daily Cost. You know, it always cracks me up. You know, it, it's, it's Harris next. Yeah, she's been copying everything he's been doing. You know, I, I don't understand how she could possibly go on something like the Joe Rogan podcast. She is not quick on her feet. She everything is scripted. We saw the 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 massive humiliating interview with Brett Bayer where she couldn't even answer a basic question on what she had actually done. I don't think a good idea is to put her on Joe Rogan's podcast for three hours unscripted he's definitely not going to be one that wants to use a script so uh it's never been like that so and he's not going to change for them especially after all the intense attacks that the left gave joe after his use of ivermectin during the c19 dilemma trying to use 
different words here, man, so we don't get in trouble here. So, but yeah, guys, so it looks like it looks like Donald Trump will be going on Joe Rogan podcast Friday, October 25th. Will it be released that day? I do not know. All right, some of the things I think they'll talk about is probably a more behind the scenes type stuff. Joe wants to know how the machine works. He wants to know what it feels like when you get into office like that. I think he's going to ask him legitimate questions. It's not going to be this run of the mill or oh, January 6th. So, I mean, it might come up, but it's not going to be something. He's not going to be lobbing attacks at Trump the entire time. You know, we'll see. We'll see how it plays out. And, you know, I think he'll have a, I think they'll have a great conversation. And I think, you know, it'll definitely come off to a much larger, larger audience than Trump could get on anything dealing with CNN or Fox News. So, and also a younger demographic. So I'm looking forward to it. I think it's going to be fantastic. Hey, I would urge Kamala Harris to go on there too, you know, and, you know, community, community, community. Small business, small business, small business, man. So, <laughs> you guys have a blessed day. Take care. You watch your own air. Nate Java, Nate Java podcast. See you guys on the next video. Mm -hmm.